again YouTube it's Lindsay here <coughs> oh, sorry um but I'm here I just wanted to make a little life update about my life <laughs> um, but as you can see I'm in a different place than I was in and like the beginning of my videos I was at my parents house in uh, Utah in a completely different state um, and now this is my boyfriend's apartment um, in Dallas Texas so I've moved back to Dallas. Well, let me let me start over. Let me refresh. <laughs> a little over two weeks ago, I came down here to to Dallas. The plan was to come see my boyfriend for a couple weeks during like my birthday was during those weeks. Uh, we went to Houston for his business trip, um, and it was really good. Just like being together, we hadn't seen each other in about two months, and we didn't really end on good terms. I didn't leave, like, it was really bad. Uh, we didn't think we were gonna see each other again. So, things happen. <laughs> Pregnancy, like, just talking to each other, trying to work things out. Uh, we decided it would be a good idea for me to come visit him. Um, and I did, and those two weeks were really great. Like, it wasn't, like, we fought a couple times, but like, it's still, uh, it's felt different than it's ever felt before in our relationship. It feels a lot I don't want to say a lot healthier, but we feel I feel like we're a lot more open with each other. We Have both like went through a really bad experience together um, and now we're both uh, Both just trying to like crawl out of that like dark hole we were in um, And we both know we're in this together um and then planning to have like a baby together puts a whole other like spin on everything. It kind of changes everything. It adds another factor basically into our relationship more than just like me and him. It's gonna, now there's a whole other person involved. Um, but yeah, we like beat those two weeks together uh, went really well and I decided um, I would rather stay here with him in Texas, then go back to Utah to live with my parents. Um, I asked him, like, is that okay? Are you gonna be able to handle that if I come, like, basically move back in with you? Um, and he said it was okay. Like, he wanted me to stay here with him as well. Um, but it's not all like sunshine and roses. Not everything has worked out. We're still, we still have a long way to go, pretty much, but we, we'd rather start on that path than like me move back and then say like, yeah, we'll try again in a couple months. Like, I think we both wanted to just start now, start trying to rebuild our relationship. Um, and then along with that, we're, I can decide if the sliding is good or not. I'll just leave it. It's like this for most of the video. <laughs> Um, but then also with that, like we're planned, we are starting to make plans for this baby that is coming in less than six months now. <laughs> it's crazy. Um, but there's like the standard stuff, like I'm getting my doctor switched or in the process of getting them switched, which we live uh, not far from, um, one of the hospitals I'll be going to. So that's really good. We'll be basically down the street for my doctor's appointments. Um, and then we both need to like start saving up money and planning where we're gonna live. Our lease, or his lease for this apartment, it ends in February and the baby is due also in February. So it's kind of, <laughs> I'm still kind of, we're trying to figure out what we're gonna do. Like we, I don't think we'll really be able to move and have a baby at the same time, you know, a newborn baby. Uh, so we're deciding like do we stay at this apartment do we uh, go somewhere else do we try to find a house do we <laughs> so we're just kind of trying to figure that out we're not really sure we still have a while to figure it out but it is something we need to start planning now so it's not last minute it's kind of a big deal so <laughs> 
And right now this apartment is a one bedroom and it's fairly small. It's, I think it's the perfect size for two people, especially like me being really small. <laughs> so I don't take up much space except for my clothes. My boyfriend might disagree. <laughs> but yeah, I don't think this apartment is big enough to have a baby here. So we, I think we want to try to find another place, but it's just a matter of February being a crazy month. Um, but that'll, that's all in due time. That'll work out. <laughs> and then my boyfriend just started a new job and it's going really well. Um, it's kind of hectic starting a new job and like a, something you're not, uh, super familiar with, like learning, <laughs> like learning new stuff. Um, but he's good on that job, but I've been thinking like, I need to, I probably need to get a job too. So we have more income coming in to save up money for the baby. Um, and I've looked at a few places. I've even like gone a few days to his job and worked as like a temporary kind of thing, just like helping clean up, help organize papers, which is really good. Um, but it's not something I like, can really count on forever, at least for like the next five months. Um, so I've been trying to like find another job that we can get like good insurance with, I can get good pay with, um, but I'm kind of conflicted on that just cause I've had, over the last three to four years, jobs have been a really big issue with me. I've kind of talked about it in previous videos. Um, but I'm just kind of like, Okay, I can't sit around and do nothing. Uh, I have to try to make money somehow in the right way. But also like going to a job and being stuck at a job, it makes me panicked a lot. But it's also, it will, it might only be for like five months. Cause when I have the baby, I do want to like stay home with it and be like on maternity leave, maybe be a stay at home mom. So that's just kind of a lot of a lot of factors to think about that I'm trying to work with. Um, I'm still doing this YouTube thing. I haven't given up on this. I do enjoy doing this. I think it's fun. I like talking to myself in a room, <laughs> pretty much. Um, but yeah, I'm focusing a lot on my hobbies. Um, me and my boyfriend have been painting together, which is really nice. I've been reading a lot more, uh, basically, like just trying to like take it easy, take care of myself, just focus on like being stable pretty much. Um, I've been feeling okay pregnancy wise. I've just been kind of fatigued. Um, my feet hurt pretty much, <laughs> but like I've been okay. But that's another worry about like, I am gonna get bigger. What if I get a job? And then all of a sudden I'm like feeling sick all the time. But I do wanna push through it like I don't think I can just sit around for five months. I need to do something or else I'm going to start getting like depressed. I need to keep busy. I need to uh, keep motivated. So I'm just trying to decide on that um, and just figure out my life out. <laughs> this is the next step. I'm here. Uh, I moved back with my boyfriend. We're working stuff out. The baby's growing, getting more, belly's getting bigger. <laughs> um, so this is just kind of a life update about like why my surroundings are different and how my videos are going to be different from now on and my life's different. Uh, I just wanted to keep you guys updated and I look like Jesus is behind me. Goodness. So bright. <laughs> um, I might do an apartment tour video. But also, maybe not, because one, that means I have to clean it up. <laughs> um, and it's not like a super big apartment, and there's a lot of like personal things in here, just like decoration-wise. So I may or may not do that, probably not. But you'll see it in the background, snippets and stuff. <laughs> what else is there? I think that's it, just a little update on what I'm up to. Um, yeah, I guess that's all for now. I'm happy to be here. I'm feeling a lot better. 
so that's great. So, Alright, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.